I mean, the inspiration really came from working with the sponsors, um, Chris and Gareth, who you've obviously seen speak tonight. I mean, they're really passionate about what they do. Um, we um, we did um, visits obviously up to um, Oxford um, Brooks University, which is a, an inspirational place in itself. I mean, the, the engineering facilities they've got there, incredible Formula One cars and that type of um, as, uh, aspect. So understanding the engineering side of things um, really inspired what we would do with the building. Obviously, again, because of it's uh, sitting in the um, railway village, we've got the histor history of the site. Uh, history of um, inventions on the site, the history of um, you know um, uh, the railway village, and obviously the industrial heritage of Swindon goes without saying in one sense. And it's a real unique opportunity to blend that old and new um, together in the building. So there was a real um, distinction of bringing back into life those um, industrial units, but also um, creating a real modern facility, which um, is really, it really is state of the art. There's um, a strong philosophy on the way that the the new building just lightly touches the old building so you can see and learn from the building itself as well so that's really key. And the spaces themselves really are um, designed around what the uses will be um, and there's a combination of both the engineering side of it is obviously a key feature so reuse of the um, existing warehouses so we put them back into use of what they were originally used for then also the new sort of hub building which is actually the sort of centre of the, of the scheme um, and that's sort of a, a, a new way of teaching in a way um, because it's a really quite open plan so it encourages, it encourages um, cross fertilisation of ideas, the accidental meet between people and actually reflects what it's like to work in a studio. Uh, our studio where we work is an open plan and you know we, and we, we um, bounce it off each other, new ideas and then that's how you create um, creative environments I think so that's been a real key feature in that as well. I think the real key difference though with the UTC is it's going to feel more like a place of work so it prepares you much better for, for moving forward into the, into the real work environment um, and obviously within that all the high tech um, uh, furniture and um, um, bits of engineering kit will be completely state of the art so it's a real unique experience I think for, for the students. Well, we've worked really closely with um, Gareth in particular, uh, our Gareth and uh, Johnson Martin are uh, the sponsors. Um, so it's been a collaborative um, process through the, through the whole, th um, through the whole, um, uh, through the whole process really. So we've interpreted how they want to run and manage the school, as I always say. Um, you know, it's not our um, UTC. You know, we, we're there to facilitate what exactly how the sponsors want to run and use that facility. So.